Hey everyone, thanks for joining us today on 2020 Flight Simmers. Today's episode is all about bush short runway takeoff and landings. So if you're into that and you want to know how to do it, stay tuned. We're using a Cessna 152 today. Uh, we are also at a custom scenery, which is Snowflake Lake in Alaska. So let's go ahead, get down below, start it up, and let's show you how we do it. Okay, so now that we're in the cockpit, uh, we're going to do run through a basic procedure, and that is make sure we have the fuel on, go ahead and turn our power on to the aircraft, then we'll go ahead and get the beacon and strobe light on. Need to leave those flaps in the up position for this one, and then go ahead and crack the throttle. Once we've done that, go ahead and hit that primer a couple times, take that little key there, and crank her over. Should fire right up once it does. You can go ahead and uh, hit that B button so we can go ahead and hit that, set that barometric uh, pressure for us. All right, bring her back to idle. Go ahead and turn on our landing lights and taxi lights. So our destination is right down here and uh, hopefully we'll make it above the trees. So how we're gonna do this, first thing uh, is first, we want to set our heading. So we are at uh, heading uh, 040. So I'm just going to come over here real quick and turn this to 040. Oops. And I could even do that here real quick. Now the only reason why I'm doing this is so that I remember uh, the runway heading. So when we get out of here, it might be hard to see, and I'd like to know uh, when we're going to be on our cross leg and our downwind leg. Uh, so by knowing the actual heading we're on really helps out. So that's just a little reminder that I set for myself. All right, let's go ahead and get this thing in the air. Full throttle. Now we're going to hold off on the flaps till the very end, then we're going to slap them down in the 20, and hopefully we'll get off the ground. Here we go. Go ahead and release that parking brake. Keep it running straight down the runway here. And hand on the flap knob. Gaining airspeed, go ahead and give us 20 degree of flaps and pull back on the yoke. Airborne, everyone. Okay, so now that we are airborne, we're going to maintain this heading of 040 uh, while we're still gaining altitude. We're going to keep in it. We can pull back the flaps now to 10 degree and check our trim down here. Make sure that uh, we can still trim it. All right, so now we're going to go ahead and turn exactly 90 degrees to the left. still maintaining our climb. So when we see 040 right there, we know we're 90 degrees. Now the airport is right there. All right, we can go ahead and bring up flaps all the way now. Now we're going to go ahead and make that 040 be directly behind us so that we can come parallel to that runway. Go ahead and make our turn. We're still at full throttle here and we're still climb. I'm going to go ahead and level us off now though. 040 is just about directly behind us. And you can come down here and see it's directly behind us. Bring us down, adjust that trim. There's Snowflake Lake right there. Boy, with this new update, the trim is very sensitive now. And we go ahead and bring back our throttle, start reducing speed. Now we can keep looking over there at that lake. Once we get about uh, 45 degrees from our wingtip to that lake, then we know we're about ready to uh, make our we're coming off course a little bit. Wrong way. Zero 
240 is the runway heading, so we want that directly behind us. Now once we get about 45 degrees off of that tip, then we can go ahead and start coming and making our left hand base turn. So I think we're about there now. Let's go. Yep. So let's go ahead and make our turn. Now again, we're going to bring 040 right here at our 9 o'clock position. And we're maintaining about 80 knots right now. Alright, we're just about at 040. And there's the runway there, so we're going to uh, turn now and bring 040 straight ahead. And we're going to start reducing throttle right now to get us down near 80 so we can give us one degree of flaps. So there we are right ahead. Go ahead and we'll bring us back down to full idle, full rich. And we're going to go ahead with 10 degree of flaps. Go ahead and put 20 degree of flaps. That'll help slow us down here. We're not going to apply full 30 degrees until we get a little bit closer. And again, we are still at idle. Haven't pulled off idle. Alright, so just maintain that. Get your feet on the brakes, get ready. Go ahead and do full flaps. Flare. And come in smoothly for our landing. And folks, that's how we do it. So I hope you enjoyed the episode today. Hit that thumbs up button. Hit subscribe and tick that little bell. Get notified on all of our future videos. Thanks again for watching 2020 Flight Simmers. We'll see you on the next one. And as always, keep the blue side up.